Hey guys, welcome back to How to Book It From Your Basement. We thought it was important to add an addendum video here about slating. For new actors, slating is just the information about you that the casting office needs for logistical reasons when filing your tape in the pile of tapes that they have. And if you're a close possibility on the part, this will have the information the producers need, such as your height, location, age if you're a minor, etc. A common misconception is that you need to put on a big show when you slate, add a big smile, have lots of energy, speak up. Those things will really just make you look like you're trying too hard. It's important to be friendly, especially for a commercial, but for the most part, this is an opportunity for casting and the director to just see you be totally natural with no filters on your persona. If we act happy with lots of energy, we can get sort of a one note commercial energy like Sean will show you here. Sean McCracken, six foot three, Raleigh, North Carolina. If we're simply natural and friendly and we just give the information asked for by casting, we get this. Sean McCracken, six foot three, Raleigh, North Carolina. Now, the second gives us a little more insight into Sean's real natural energy. We can see he's a nice guy and not crazy and that if we hire him, he will probably be pretty easy to work with. These things go a long way for a production staff who spends 14 hour days with actors. Slating simply also gives the impression that you've auditioned before. So you start to also look more experienced and comfortable on camera and less like you need the job. Another good way to think about it is like dating. If you come off desperate or too excited, you might look like you haven't had a date in a while and scare them off. It is so nice to finally meet you. My name is Sean McCracken. I'm six foot three. I live in Raleigh, North Carolina. And I really, really hope that you love me. I mean, uh, hire me for this acting job. <laughs> Where are you going? No, no, wait. No, no, I'm perfect for this part. I, I can show you my, my gaming video. I mean, my, my reel. But please hire me. I'm so perfect for this. As you can see, he might scare off the perfect match, a date or a job. Or again, he could simply be himself in the moment and this might be what we get. Hey, it's nice to finally meet you. I'm Sean McCracken, I'm six foot three. I live in Raleigh, North Carolina. You live in Raleigh? I lived there when I was a kid. Wait, what part? Uh, in North Raleigh. I, I... Now, obviously we added some comments in there for context, but with a slate, be simple and expedient. Because remember, casting is always looking at a lot of tapes. Just state the information requested briefly, let them see you for a beat after you're done talking, and that's it. It should be a relaxed, calm, and real moment. Also, adding personal notes to casting is not usually smart, even if you know them, because if the producers wanna see your slate, that will be in it as well and might look unprofessional. Another technique sometimes used is to sort of stay in the energy of the character. When I coach people for tapes, I usually have them slate at the end. They have just finished the scene, so their energy still has the residue of the character. So sometimes letting that be underneath in the slate gives another layer that makes them look like even more of a fit naturally. Don't ever come back here. I don't ever want to see you again. Sean McCracken, six foot three. Now, you'll notice he didn't seem friendly in the slate, but subtly had a layer of the energy of the character still in his body. If done right, casting will like this because they'll understand what Sean is doing. It's a subtle way to show them even more of your character without slating totally in character. Don't ever come back here. I don't ever want to see you again. Sean McCracken, six foot three. That's a little much, but when in doubt, just keep it simple, let your guard down for them, and just talk. We hope this has been helpful. And we really hope to see you again. We, we really had a good time, like, like yeah. okay, really. Okay, they heard you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, are you sure? Because yes, I, we I'm sure really, really did. Okay. okay, see you next chapter. Bye.